Hello and welcome to the world's top 10. If you like our channel, please subscribe and ring the bell for all the latest top 10s. With the current fears over coronavirus and the potential pandemic the world is worrying about, today we are looking at the top 10 most deadly infections ever known to man. At number 10, it's HIV AIDS. AIDS was first clinically observed in 1981 in the United States of America, but it is thought that the first ever recorded case originated in Belgian Congo in 1959. There are two different categories of HIV, one and two, and transmission of the infection happens through human bodily fluids. Since its official diagnosis, AIDS has killed 35 million people worldwide and another 34 million live with the virus. Good treatment via antiviral drugs is now available, but a cure or a vaccine to date has yet to be discovered. Number nine, SARS, Severe Acute Respiratory Syndrome. SARS is a viral respiratory disease caused by the SARS coronavirus. Between November 2002 and July 2003, an outbreak of SARS in southern China caused an eventual 8,098 cases, resulting in 774 deaths reported in 17 countries, a mortality rate of 9.6%. No cases of SARS have been reported worldwide since 2004, but if it returns, it has the potential to become one of the biggest killers of modern mankind. Number 8. Measles Measles is a highly contagious infectious disease caused by the measles virus. Most estimates based on modern molecular biology place the emergence of measles around 500 AD. It's estimated to have killed over 300 million people throughout history. Seven to eight million children are thought to have died from measles each year before the vaccine was introduced. In 1954, the first vaccine was propagated and the modern measles vaccine is effective at preventing the disease, is exceptionally safe and is often delivered in combination with other vaccines. Vaccination resulted in an 80% decrease in deaths and is on course to be eradicated in the next 50 years. Number 7. Polio. Polio, or infantile paralysis, is an infectious disease caused by the polio virus. It causes muscle weakness. Many people fully recover, but between 2 to 5% of children and 15 to 30% of adults die. The disease is preventable with the polio vaccine. Polio has existed for thousands of years with depictions of the disease in ancient art, but was first recognised as a disease in 1789. Over 400 million people throughout history have died of polio. In 2018, the disease was declared to be eradicated, but small clusters of infection can still occur in developing countries. Number six, leprosy. Leprosy, also known as Hansen's disease, is caused by bacteria. It causes damage of the nerves, respiratory tract, skin and eyes. This nerve damage may result in a lack of ability to feel pain, which can lead to the loss of extremities due to unnoticed wounds. Leprosy symptoms may begin within 1 to 20 years of infection. Leprosy is spread between people through a cough or nasal fluid. The oldest skeletal evidence for the disease dates from 2000 BC. The first treatment for leprosy became available in the 1940s and now modern and effective treatment exists, although the disease is becoming resistant to some drugs. Whilst the disease itself is not always fatal, it can cause infection that can lead to death if not treated. Leprosy is physically debilitating and carries great historical social stigma. At number 5, Ebola. Ebola virus disease, or simply Ebola, 
is a viral hem hemogenic fever of humans and other primates. The disease has a high risk of death, killing 25% to 90% of those infected. The virus is transmitted by direct contact with body fluids and from contaminated items. Spread may also occur from contact with items recently contaminated. An Ebola vaccine was created in the USA in December 2019, but as yet there is no approved treatment or cure for Ebola. Between 1976 and 2013, there were a reported 24 outbreaks involving 2,387 cases with 1,590 deaths. But the largest outbreak to date was in West Africa, which occurred from December 2013 to January 2016, with 28,646 cases and 11,323 deaths. Ebola is currently present in the Democratic Republic of Congo. Number 4. Influenza Influenza, known informally as flu, are a variety of virus pathogens that have many different strains. Avian flu, swine flu, dog flu, horse flu, Spanish and human flu are all illnesses caused by strains of influenza viruses. The flu virus frequently mutates to create a new virus, which most people have little or no immune protection against. There have been about nine influenza pandemics during the last 300 years. Pandemics can cause high levels of mortality, with the 1918 Spanish flu pandemic being the worst in recorded history. This pandemic was estimated to be responsible for the deaths of approximately 50 to 100 million people. A total death rate is impossible to calculate but experts say it could be higher than bubonic plague deaths. At number three, malaria. Malaria is a mosquito-borne infectious disease that affects humans and animals when bitten by a virus carrying fly. Evidence of this disease has been detected in tissue and DNA samples of animals from at least 100,000 years ago. Malaria causes symptoms that typically include fever, tiredness, vomiting and headaches. In severe cases, it can cause yellow skin, seizures, coma or death. Over 228 million people have died from malaria, with an estimated half a million deaths each year. Treatment is available, but a successful eradication of this disease is still being sought. At number two, smallpox. Smallpox was an infectious disease caused by two virus variants. The risk of death following contracting the disease was about 30%, with higher rates among babies. Often, those who survived had extensive scarring of their skin and some were left blind. The origin of smallpox is unknown. The earliest evidence of the disease dates to the 3rd century BC in Egyptian mummies. The disease historically occurred in outbreaks. In 18th century Europe, it is estimated 400,000 people per year died from the disease. Smallpox is estimated to have killed up to 300 million people in just the 20th century and around 500 million people in the last 100 years of its existence. Edward Jenner discovered in 1798 that vaccination could prevent smallpox and eventually the disease was declared eradicated in 1980. And at number one is the plague. Plague is the common name for three types of disease caused by the bacterium Yersinia pestis. Bubonic plague, septicemic plague and pneumonic plague. They cause flu-like symptoms, including fever, headaches, and vomiting. Swollen and painful lymph nodes occur in the area closest to where the bacteria entered the skin. Antibiotics are now a successful treatment for plague. Without treatment, plague results in the death of 30 to 90% of cases. Plague still exists today. 
but there have been three major recorded pandemics throughout history. The first being in the 6th century, killing 25 to 50 million people. The second in the 14th century, where it killed a third of the world's population. The third pandemic again began in China and killed 30 million people in the mid 19th century. Known as the Black Death, it has been the world's biggest killer and earns its number one spot. So, COVID-19 has a long way to go before it enters our top 10. But don't forget, wash your hands and cover your coughs and sneezes. For more top 10s, please like our channel and subscribe.